Hey guys, here's another thing you can do with some of your leftover eggnog. You can make eggnog French toast. And it's really easy, you just take your your bread. I used some French bread, I sliced it pretty thick because I like it thick. And just soak it in the nog. And the key to a good French toast, um, I, I, I never used to really like French toast that much because I didn't like egg when I was a kid. If it wasn't well cooked, it was really gross. And the French toast would get like soggy in the middle and I didn't like it. And I think a lot of people do this where they, they take like regular soft bread and dip it very quickly in the egg and milk mixture so that it doesn't soak the bread. And then they cook it at too high a heat and it's like brown on the outside and raw on the inside. And I found that the key to a good French toast, and you know, you can see how thick it is, is to, you know, let it soak really well so that it gets all the way inside and then to cook it very, you have to just be patient, you have to cook it very slowly at a medium low heat so that the inside sets like custard and the outside doesn't burn and that's the way I like it and this is really especially nice because of the flavor of the eggnog of course the um, I already have the the um, eggnog recipe up so I will have that linked and I will describe this too in the description I'll put it on my blog and link it uh, in the description so this will be like starting off a bunch of like, you know, holiday leftover stuff, leftover eggnog French toast. And probably this will appear Sunday morning and then I'll have another like Sunday dinner recipe, but then probably starting Monday I'm just going to knock it down to one video a day. So I will see you later guys.